how to set up a shared master node on the iHostMN platform. In order to participate in the shared master node, you will need the following. The wallet of your chosen coin to send coins from and to withdraw rewards to. To set up a shared master node on the iHostMN platform, you must have the coins wallet and a receive address created for where your shared master node rewards can be withdrawn to. Once you have all this in place, you are ready to set up a shared master node. How to set up and configure a shared master node. In this next section of the video, I will show you all the steps you need to take to successfully set up a shared master node using the iHostMN platform. Log in to the iHostMN platform and click on the master node sharing tab on the left hand menu. In here, you'll be able to navigate the current available shared master nodes on offer. So for this example, I'm going to select dash green. In order to participate in any shared master node, you will need to generate a deposit address to send your coins to and paste details of your wallet's withdrawal address to receive rewards to when you wish to withdraw your balance. Go ahead and click on the button labeled get deposit address. You will now be prompted with this screen, advising that in order to get your deposit address, you will first need to enter your withdrawal address. Open your wallet, in this case, dash green, and either generate a new receiving address or copy an existing one. Now go ahead and paste this receive address into the box provided. Now click on the add withdrawal address button and your deposit address will be generated. Next, from your wallet of your chosen coin, in my case dash green, send an amount that is less than the masternode collateral required to your new deposit address within the iHostMN platform. You will need to wait for three confirmations before your deposit will show in the system. Then, once your shared masternode has reached the required amount of coins needed for a masternode, you will start to see rewards building up in your account. If your coin happens to be a proof of stake coin, you will start to receive staking rewards right away before your shared masternode reaches the required collateral to be activated as a masternode. How to check for rewards earned and withdraw your balance. Once your shared master node has been up and running for some time, you'll be able to check how much you have earned in rewards from the iHostMN dashboard. Simply navigate to the client area in the left hand menu and click on dashboard view. This view shows all your current investments including master nodes and shared master nodes. You will see what you have running and if you scroll down you will see a section called Masternode Sharing Deposits. As you can see in my account, I have two shared masternodes. One is for Serial Coin and the other is for Dash Green. You will notice a number of tabs that indicate how much of that coin you have and how much you have earned. As you can see here, I have earned almost 32 Dash Green coins in rewards. If you are happy with this amount, and now wish to withdraw your investment and rewards, simply click on the button labelled Withdraw under the Actions tab. The pop screen will detail the withdrawal address you entered when you first set up your shared masternode, and the total amount of coins that will be deposited back to you, whilst also indicating the total of coins earned. You don't have to withdraw all your coins, you could simply just withdraw your current earned coins by typing into the withdrawal amount box the number earned, in my case, 32. Then, simply click the green withdrawal button. Your withdrawal will be processed and you'll see this success message. Your coins will appear in your wallet shortly after, as you can see here with my dash green appearing almost instantly into my desktop wallet. That's it, incredibly simple and user friendly and a great way to earn masternode rewards without having to have enough coins for a full masternode. 
please check out our other videos for more tutorials and how to use all the features of the iHostMM platform. Thanks for watching.